Hey everyone, I'm Chris, and thanks for watching North Haven News. Summer's flying by, November's creeping up on us, town elections will be here before you know it, and both the North Haven Democrats and Republicans held their nominating conventions last week. Now, there were no surprises from the Republicans who held their convention at the Holiday Inn in Washington Avenue. It was pretty much a given that first selectman Mike Freer would run for re-election, and after State Senator Len Fasano nominated him, it was official. Also running for re-election is second selectman Tim Doheny. Now the big question was whether the Democrats were even going to put up a candidate to run against Frieda. It's even speculated Mike Frieda may run unopposed as many think he's unbeatable at this point. Well, the Democrats did nominate a candidate for first selectman and the few people I've talked to about it think he's probably the best person they could have gotten to run against Mike Frieda. And that person is Walt Spader. Now, Walt was the Connecticut's Democratic Party Communications Director from 1996 to 2000, and he publishes a blog called The North Haven Democrat. Running for second selectman is former town tax collector Alan Sturtz. Now, a full list of both party candidates can be found on my website at NorthHavenNews.com, so let the campaigning begin. Thanks once again for joining me here, as always. Questions, comments, and feedback can be sent to NorthHavenNews at gmail.com. Don't forget, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and iTunes, and I'll see you next time. Bye.